hey welcome guys this is jasminder so today i'm here to discuss about the customization of the space layout or the interface customization we can say so here i am in the jsp ui that is java server pages user interface there are two interfaces for d space uh, one is jsp ui and one is xml ui so i will be talking about jsp ui here uh, how to customize the jsp ui according to your university or college details yeah this is xml ui but we'll be focusing on this jsp ui so i would like to say sorry for delayed uploading this video as i said a library is not my core profession even even for this customization i had to research about how to do this okay well let's start about the titles and other details first of all we will do this how to change the titles uh, in like this and uh, for that we need to go c drive d space config and d space dot config i recommend notepad plus plus for the configuration uh, customization purposes because notepad and default windows notepad is not enough for doing this much because of the uh, not that clean ui you can say anyway so well here is the title um, d space at my university yes this is the name of your d space installation uh, we will go with a standard name that is stand for uh, not a standard actually i mean just a random name stand for university okay i ju just save the file after changing just save the file okay if you have a mobile users if you have a different uh, url for the mobile users you can put that here nothing else to be changed uh, let's save it and after every save we have to restart the tomcat server start and it should change the values it takes some time yeah stand for university we have a new name here stand for university so these uh, these titles you can change here uh, the next customization of changing the layout like a logo or these things removing editing these things will be done from the web apps folder of the tomcat where we moved the web apps files of dspace uh, web apps jsp ui there are two folders xml ui and jsp ui so well for each and every page there uh, there is a file in this folder that you can customize you need to know html and css a bit to edit these files so well about the the first page that loads here is the home to the jsp let's open it okay well uh, if you are good with html and then you can look for the classes here uh, top news okay well here it says top news jump yeah yeah one let me tell something let's see the class of this dev class 
jumbo drone jumbo drone yeah okay now let's look this class in the file home dot gsp jumbo drone and what what's the value of jumbo drone that is top news what's the top news variable says here top news is equal to read news file stuff 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 news top dot html now we need to locate this file where this file is um, well this file is known in this jsp ui folder it it is in the c b space config and here uh, new stop yeah here is the here are these two files uh, new stop dot html okay it says this text is here it is face at my university so to edit this text we have we have to change the text here or you can just remove this uh yeah well let's let's change it here and just to show you guys stand food uh, i'm trying to keep this <clears throat> video pretty much short while explaining everything not everything actually this space is quite vast okay well uh, i just saved the file and it should it should be changed now now let's let's remove this this is default installation how to find this thing uh, jumbotron yeah it's also in the jumbotron um, <clears throat> top news and where is the next data here okay well uh, side news let's find side news here yeah yeah here it is in the call for you can see in the call md4 is a class name and here is that html code where it says side news so to change the side news we have to edit the next html file which is here new side edit and we i'm gonna remove this default text and save the file now let's let's restart to see if everything is going well Re refresh with the refresh this should be gone this should be replaced with stanford university if all goes well and one two three okay that is gone and it is replaced by Stanford University so well uh, there are a lot of customization you can change by editing those values two more things uh, I would like to cover in this video one is how to change the images well, there's an easy way to change this logo and everything just find the file uh, where it locates image d space logo only dot png now in the jsp ui folder in that under tomcat installation we have a folder name image now here we can change all the images and replace with our images pretty much easy as that uh, suppose we need this d space blue to be our logo just 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 put the file name uh, replace the file name like d space blue uh, d space logo only is the uh, logo file name we'll just rename this to old it's a png file yeah and what it, this is a gif file we need to look for a png do we have a png no there are no png files cool well yeah here is a png file so i will just name it to this one and here 
I just named it here and now I need to restart start service and refresh Oops. Okay, the logo is replaced. Well, the one more thing I would like to tell here uh, for the people who know the HTML and uh, sorry CSS, the CSS file is located in in the static directory. CSS bootstrap D space theme. Suppose you are not not getting some kind of text in the JSPU file and you want that to be removed. So you can just find the class name. For example, we have a we need to remove this part and it's it says class banner and container. We can't remove the container class we can remove the container class too but let's let's just move by the banner class open the css file and just write display no. it will it will remove the css file oh sorry it will remove the this section And refresh. Well, uh, well, I'm not sure if, if I could cover a lot about the customization, but but I would like to tell that this space is quite vast to customize. Oh, it's it's not removed. Oh yeah, I forgot to save stop service and start again yeah i was telling uh, i'm not sure if i was able to cover most of the things about the customization well i i uh, the most i can do is you can you can contact me on my twitter my twitter this is the handler of my twitter you can uh, tweet me uh, send a tweet to my twitter about any kind of queries or where you need to know about the customization i can help you with that uh, i can't cover the everything about the customization because as i said uh, it, it, it's quite large software so yeah th that's all for the customization part uh, yeah let's refresh to see if it's gone yeah it's gone so pretty much uh, pretty much that for today so in the next video i i will cover how to make your dspace installation live on the internet so yeah see you guys in in the next video uh, thanks for watching Jasminder Singh.